All right. Oh boy. <laughs> Time to spellman farm. So the best spot that I've been told about is Storm Riven Hall. So we'll see if that holds up. people to show. <laughs> Tough like that. Is there really only one in this realm? I don't know, there's a second one over here. <laughs> will, it even, will it even let me hit that? Ah, dub. Two cantrip chests in this round. Anybody coming through the stream, y'all are welcome to come to Grey Rose Realm. Cast your little magic touch. I got some people here, but I think they're just questing. What's up, Manny? Welcome to the stream. If you want to come by and do some uh, some mind numbing spellment farming, I'm in Grey Rose Realm. Sounds like kind of dumb that we've got to do it like this, but this is the most efficient way, unfortunately.
going to tag in my Discord. <laughs> Sometimes. Hero Miscellanea. What is that badge? All side quests of Grizzlime. How about that? This is actually just dead content now. <laughs> it's like people already did all their farming in the first week, so now there's nobody trying to do it anymore. That, that would kind of suck. I think I need to make this uh, stream title a bit more enticing. Okay. That should be a better title. Got a floating land. We got chests. I need one more. But uh, what realm? That title change. Yup. Guarantee you, more people are gonna click on the stream now. Ambrose. Let me see if it's. Uh... No, it's not full. Okay, gas. Okay. I have not farmed in the floating land before. Is this y'all? Alright, I guess so. <laughs> Alright. How's this, uh... Works for me. What do we get from that? Uh, we got at least one 
Frost Giants, so that's good. Alright, I'll follow you. Alright, okay, running around here is just like a pain. Is there even like a feasible way to get around these? I don't think there is. This has sort of got the same problem that Trump Jungle had for a while there. Okay. Actually, just put one here. How about that? <laughs> I didn't even see it. All right, gas. That's two. There was that other guy. I don't know if he's AFK or what, but... I guess we can keep looking for another. And I don't get pulled because I have like no damage gear on at 26. Gas. I assume the next one's this way. and balance ones from that one. I 
Yeah, it's probably just more worth it to go around this way. Does this one respawn? Nope, not yet. Guess that means the next one's in the ruined village. You know what? Just so I don't, I'm not like going way quicker than that, I'm gonna use the new map. <laughs> I got this from the free pack, actually. Oh, this one here. Er, wait, no, that's <laughs> that's the one that he missed before. Survey camp is also another good spot. I, right. I'm just rocking with the floating land for now. But if the chests start to dry up a bit, then uh, I guess we can head there. Walking around this general location has honestly got me so sussed. We found one over here, I think. Alright, it's not back yet. Wouldn't it be easier to just buy packs with empowers? Uh, easier said than done. <laughs> it's like, I've got a, a couch potato farm and all that, but... It is, uh... It has not produced nearly enough... To... Like, net me enough of that. There's one back up here. Michael. It spawned like right after we walked past it. But I've been thinking, if I like made gardens on all of my wizards, I could probably get a lot more powers. And it wouldn't be as bad. And yeah, I'm guessing it's back to the TP hub. I bet. This one's back. I wonder how quickly it's going to just drain my energy. <laughs> I've got a bunch of characters that I can use for it at least, so it's not so bad. I'm not chancing that. I'm just going to go around the other way. If you had like two to three farms per wizard, yeah, that's, uh, <laughs> that's, that's a lot of effort. Farming cantrip, sleeper, absolutely frenzy. Game energy, your physical energy. Oh, if I had physical energy before, I won't after this. Getting all frost giant, you're stealing them from me. So I guess the next one will be over this direction. Yeah, I skill, do you think you can make a nice setup with that raid gear that's decent to run? If you mean for Pave, not really. You'd need probably full burrower, and you'd have to run probably Skyfair and Thame for the triangle slot. And then your health would tank immensely. That's how bad it is. Okay, no chest there. Here's one. Toby. Can you actually train a power for packs? Uh, yeah, people do that on Gamma's training post. A friend of mine owns that. And yeah, 
something over here. <laughs> Bought like 50 packs the other day, but now I'm all out of the powers, yeah. That's how it goes. Seeing this honestly makes me depressed, like why do they think this is good, for real. I guess there's one this way. Yeah, or... I don't know, but I guess the only reason you'd be going over here, right? There, yeah, there is. How much empires powers per pack? Uh, it's probably... I can't really remember. I haven't really bought any packs from uh, Gamma's Trade and Post. But it's it's going to be half of what a normal pack is, I would assume. Because uh, the price is about half that. See, I mean, Scott already got this. Apparently there's a maintenance tonight. <laughs> I refuse to chance that, Michael. I'm just going to say it. There's no safe way to go that way. But there is one over here, so... At least there's that. Will there be one over here? Yes, there will. Some route this is. <laughs> oh, that one over here. And over here. It's also lining up kind of nicely with the <laughs> with the cooldown. Yeah, and then this one always seems to swan. Last time I did the scanship chest for rank 7, I got so many forest lords, yeah. How many have I even got? I'll just see. I guess they're still running the route. Honestly, <laughs> I'm just gonna start running the route just on my own. And uh, they can pick it up as they go. Let's look at Fire Dragon first. 30 so far, that's not bad. Frost Giant. 24. Okay, no chest here. No chest by Bristle Claw. Is there a chest in the ruined village? No, no chest in the ruined village. Or maybe we're just going too fast. I don't know. <laughs> Likes to spawn in these are decent, but wow, <laughs> they make the farming method worse. That's real. Especially because it costs energy, it's like... I wish I could just... I guess you can technically farm, like you did with Arc 1. Did really miss this one? I responded to your ping, but I'm doing Beastman, yeah. And yeah, they did miss that one.
out that I didn't get pulled. <laughs> I guess once I get below 130 energy, I'll switch back to my main set. I literally said, how, how can we make the experience as boring as possible? That's real. Okay, this one respawned. Not seeing one in the ruined village this time around. One by Bristle Claw did respawn at least, but nothing by Wild Craig. This one still has two, then. Yeah, I already hit that. I wonder if I'll catch up to him. <laughs> to be honest, I should probably be sticking with him, so that way... Alright, yeah, I can catch up to him. Who knows? I guess he's getting on a new character. Yeah, I'll probably come through and uh, get on my others as well. Should have thrown on energy here on them. Not that I have much, but still. That one's not back yet. Down there. Which, yeah, this reminds me of how annoying Gadget Farming is for getting materials for characters that require exploration and memorization locations. Yeah. Felt. Finish up this rotation and then probably head back to the start so we can reconvene. Scott's still around. All my energy is going towards raid prep nowadays. Yeah, I feel that. You gotta be getting that level 7 can trips. Which I don't even think I have. Yeah, level 5 on this character. But Ice doesn't ever really use can trips much. But yeah, I'm gonna wait by this. The beach camp. We can reconvene here. Ambrose is full. Oh, uh, tough. Uh, we could probably go to Grey Rose. 
storm is waiting on energy to cast the rest of my snake DC for real. Uh, but yeah, let's go to Grey Rose. Checked down the beach, and there wasn't one. Watch Grey Rose be full now, yeah. It, it, Grey Rose usually is fine. Nothing by Bristleclaw. Do you need, uh, do you think we need a third? <laughs> that is why, that is why I, uh, I always come through. Way behind the sigil, that's a neat spot. Yeah, uh, there's actually a bunch like that, I noticed. Not one there. Okay with Realm Orthrus is myth, yeah. Prep in library recently on my fire to be able to get my ice up. Yeah, I feel that. At least the ice isn't like stupid to quest now. <laughs> yeah, this one's already been hit. So it looks like we may need a third. If anybody from the stream. I'd like to come to Guerrero's realm in the floating land Celestia. Please do. This map goes hard. I can hop on my second account if you really need it. <laughs> I mean, we do need a fairy dead shot, so if you want to. Gilded Man is starting to move to Crying Sky. Yeah, it's a pretty big transition for Guild to do. Crying Sky is uh, real tough, like that. Hardest endgame content. They said that the Polaris raid isn't going to be as bad, so I guess we got that to look forward to. Hop on chat, exactly. Did <laughs> you far from the mountain or you got that streamer luck? I got this from uh, the free pack, from that code.
Got a burn book worm for my second free pack from the loyalty store, yeah. It seems like it's got a better drop rate than Mount does. That's what uh, no 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 no. Don't switch to another ways because it'll it'll delete one of the one of the uh, magic touches that you did on this one. Oh, well. Or maybe that's just for guilds. I don't know. <laughs> that's how it works for guild gates, you know what I mean? But if it works for this, then uh, that's fine. Mr. Emerald Fountain, welcome. That boy dead shot. Gas. So yeah, I guess we can just follow the route as normal. I think there wasn't one by over there. But we can take a look. And see if one spawned. Yo, well, it's good, Greg. Welcome to the stream. I'm doing the most mind-numbing thing that you could possibly ever think of doing in Wiz, and yeah, there was nothing by Bristle Claw. Third by Oak Sandbag, 90%. That's huge. Been rocking that lately. <laughs> been making it out of the Nightmare Dungeon, for real. I haven't even been back since I finished it up on my Myth. But yeah, it looks like, uh... Okay, so to be honest, I should really just use this and Agile to a group. So let's do that. And then add Michael. And then, yeah, y'all can ride in the clown car with me. W50%. Or. Yeah. <laughs> I guess. Hey, there we go. Have a desync. <laughs> I should probably farm. Rank 7 spellments for my balance. Don't have any more tests until May, so I actually have time for Whisper Wads. Yay. Fine. Yoink. And uh, I think just Deadshot needs to touch this one. through or <laughs> I don't even know what's going on okay right I guess power nova spellments uh, from these chests that uh, made that shot and Michael are hitting right now oh, this would uh, just spawn actually do I need to get out of the car to touch uh, if it lets you cantrip at it, <laughs> then big dub. I should probably take us closer. Can I farm Chris for this? You can, but this is for the rank 7 specifically. T-Sync is crazy with this. Alright. Big dub. And I think this one is also just that shot. <laughs> yeah, try not to get pulled. Uh, I don't know how the desync is working with that, but... Okay, uh, that one I think did respawn, but I'm gonna check this... Say... Oh, there is. Say less. Big 
dead. Then we can hit up the next one. <laughs> it's looking like y'all are missing, but it's the desync. I need to do this before I go back on my balance, to be honest. Nova being better than Orth might make Azteca semi-bearable. That's for real. I hope it doesn't just spit y'all out in the middle of the <laughs> Sky Creepers. It'll be kind of crazy. Ain't nobody touched before I got touched. Ooh. What cantrip level do I need to be? Uh, you just need to be level 1. High enough to... Or I should, uh, High enough to no magic touch. Nope. <laughs> he really just kobe did all the way from over there. Moving to beast moon, all good. Probably do more of these streams in the future, though. Is there one here? Not quite. Okay. Ooh, don't want to pull that. <laughs> that would be awkward. We do have one over here. I'd probably uh, transfer the car over. <laughs> yeah, for real. But yeah, once I'm out of energy on this guy. In that some pagoda. It's been a minute since I've done that. I'm surprised this one didn't spawn. Usually it does. Do we got one down here? Nope. I feel like I haven't been getting very many <coughs> frost giants. Thirty-nine, as opposed to fire dragon, which I've got forty-one of. Which, yeah, it's not that big a difference. I do feel like. Getting more spirit ones though. Let me see the life spells. Oh yeah, 48 Forest Lord, for sure. I yeah, like punishing you for being too vocal for Frost Giant Change, for real. <laughs> My high school can't get the Ice 7 pit, that's real. Curse of KI, absolutely. Do I got 51 and then 46 Nova and only 38 Orthrus. Interesting. 
One over here, nope. This one came back. Gonna have to switch soon. Yeah, same here. I've got 98 at the moment. <laughs> Silencing ice plays, playing ice phobia for real. Any on the blue sky beach? Let's see. There is. <laughs> it's crazy how I'm averaging like one of each spellment. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> but yeah, it's crazy how I'm averaging like one of each of these spellments per chest. And I need 685 <laughs> to level them all the way up to tier 5. That's crazy to me. Stream your balance and mirage gives me hope that balance will eventually. That's not the right button. Eventually, escape the Azteca trenches. I'll probably stream it. Stream a little bit of it. That is the plan. Eight frost giants, that's crazy. What part is frost giant spell are useless on this account? Uh, yeah. Now, did somebody miss? Or no. Have me blue make it out of the Great Spire yet? Uh, she did. She did indeed. I'll be on recording. Hey, switch. I. Right. We will wait by this chest in Grey Rose. You love farming, don't you? Oh boy, yes I do. I love mindlessly spamming a chest over and over. This is such a fun game. Wizard game facts. Just wait until the energy runs out and you don't have enough spellments, you'll love the game even better then. Hell yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna pass this uh, creepy clown card to all of my characters. So we can just keep farming this for as long as I've got energy. <laughs> the B dance, hell yeah. I gotta unequip them out, I guess. The 
No seizure is so real, for real. Stream gold slowly loses his sanity. Absolutely. <laughs> oh yeah, did you like the frost giant buff? Yes, it was very refreshing to see. <laughs> Y'all love to see that, don't you? All the future is gonna be still staying. Yeah. After all of the campaigning I had to do to get frost giant buffed, you know. The, the gas robe. Even with the frost giant buff, it's still the worst by far, yeah. That is true. It even still does less damage than Scarecrow, which I think is crazy. The campaign for Frost Giant Brown kills your chances of EC, though. People still haven't heard back, is the thing. That's the main thing. I don't know if my chances are, like, killed, <laughs> but... It's just I haven't even found out yet. It keeps getting pushed back. But I got what I came for, you know. I got I got frost jam buffed. I'll take that. Is the scarecrow used to pave? Uh I mean it's like Scarecrow's in like a bit of a weird spot for Peeve, because it's like it's it's good just as an AoE drain. You can use it to really like pressure a myth as a death, which like helps you in the counter matchup. So like they, they, they won't Yaga you. But this is what it is. It's on US immigration phase for real. Getting all power over now <laughs> don't even have a balance, I feel that. Deadshot's getting frost giant, Michael's getting power nova. Wild out of here. Yeah, I've heard Bone Dragon is a good blade counter now. But I mean, people don't really be using blades like that. Extra credit is more nerve wracking than college abs. <laughs> yeah, I mean. It's crazy out of here. Don't like how it feels like it's only Ice who's there making a school identity for. Yeah. It's like <clears throat> for It's like people there there were people who didn't want Frost Giant to get buffed because Ice was the last one with any identity. But <clears throat> it's like Identity is chalked otherwise. So it's like, might as well just make the game not infinitely worse for ice. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what identity for real? Like pirate IQ for identity? Yeah, they haven't they haven't massacred it over there yet. I mean, uh, <laughs> Musketeer, Witch Doctor, and uh, Privateer are all played relatively similarly, but don't worry about it. 
That was lost in Blade AoE meta was the norm, that's real. It's like, Blade AoE was still the best for Ice, it's just, it was worse than everybody else by a long shot. So I'm glad that they uh, did something about that with this update. Identity hasn't been shit since uh, Rushing Bow started. They've like... <clears throat> they've tried to do a little bit with that. But it's like, some schools get the, the short end of the stick with that. That was uh, that shot out of energy. Nope. I guess he's got invites off. I would never be out of energy on God. I did hit it, right? Maybe I'm down. Yeah, I did. How do you feel about this, in my opinion? Think which should be a debuffing dot class? I mean, they have done... It's like Mornsong and all of that. It could be... It could work like that. Still got him off. <laughs> Storm's bugged, can't get invites. Um. Okay. Let me... Okay, how about you make the group? And then invite us. I should expand more on that because it's basically worse musket, yeah. It's like, which, which is sort of like, like death, in the sense that you have drains and all that. But it's also more in line than death is in Wiz. Am I driving? Yeah, you are. <laughs> anyway, technically, I guess. I guess I could. That's up in. <laughs> I'm sure by this point he knows the route, so. Thanks. I can hit approximately seven more chests. I don't know why I was talking about school identity and protecting it while they introduced cosplay, which absolutely murders school identity. Yeah, for real. Make sure bro isn't under the influence of the ways police are watching. For real. Not one over here, tough. I should expand more on that because it's basically the worst musket. Yeah, it's like the idea of drains with like the Jobu spells. It could be good. And like Witch Hunter, Witch Hunter is sort of a problem just in and of itself. I'll say that. It'll be toward the village. Uh, wrong way. <laughs> you know what? How about this? I was gonna say, cause like, this'll, this'll take us back to base camp, but, uh, I was more talking about the Watermill Village. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. The route do be confusing. Been through Celestia in years, that's a blessing. <laughs> you're, you're lucky for that. Does Witch do solid damage at all, or is it kinda trash? I remember selecting it a few... Hold on. Times playing early game, but haven't tried the other classes. Spell power reliant, yeah. So basically, if you're on a spell power reliant school, like witch doctor, like privateer, like musketeer, 
um, you're gonna need scratch. <laughs> and even then, that doesn't really kick in until level 34-ish, which is when he promotes for the second time and gets that 100%. All classes are to an extent, but with more sips, their base stats are bad, and it's hard to hit enemies even after debuffing them a bunch. Yeah, it's like the, the fizzle chance I always thought was just straight up odd with regular witch attacks. Gonna hand off the bed. Good luck with the rank 7 spell for him, yeah. Appreciate it, yummy. But yeah. Scratch, uh... Scratch is pretty much the lifeblood of most of the pirate. It's like Buccaneer is the only class that I don't really think can use him that well. What staff is that actually? Oh, it's gas. <laughs> the fire's back. I just need to make ice better, but somehow keeping it in line. No, sir. All right. Okay. There are we getting another. <laughs> Am I inviting this? Okay. I would say. It's hard to really put ice in line. Because... I mean, most of it is just wanting to hit as hard as a life wizard can. So there's honestly still room to buff it, <laughs> which is kind of crazy. Looking forward to the new KI game. Yeah, it could be interesting. Oh, and then they're going to charge a triple A price for it. I'm not paying 60 bucks, yeah. Four fire dragon out of that. I am going to need to uh, trade this clan car over to another character shortly, though. If they're hitting school, for real. It's like, I don't know if that should mean life should come down, or if I should come up, but... It's sort of just that whole principle of, uh... Two non-hitting classes. And I'm gonna hit this one over here, and then after I do, I'm going to trade the car over. <laughs> we really burned through almost 300 energy. Go crazy. Alright. So I'm gonna toss this one into the shared bank and I'm gonna come back on my storm that's this probably not coming out until 2026 yeah I can see that happening do you have a tapestry of the floating land you do not Tough. MGM made promises at 21 if I still have a follow through with three years later, yeah. Crazy out of here. Alright, no, that's, uh, that's not floating land, that is Storm Ribbon. Mirage music hits as hard as it always has, facts. Yeah, I'm still hoping that uh, the next pirate update is a world. Because I was... It's like, I knew that it wasn't going to be a world this time. But, I mean... Yeah, it's probably quicker for me to go this way.
It would have been nice to get a level cap increase, is the main thing. And then where is Michael? Or Michael might be getting on another character. Why does a nice drag give a shield instead of a stun? That's better, but at least useful. Yeah, it's just the problem is... If it gets a shield tacked on, chances are it loses damage. So... Oh well, I guess. Do I need to hit this? With how much they were hyping it up, I thought they were going to have a new... I guess I do. I thought they were going to have a new Pirate World in 2022. Yeah. I was hoping so, but... A rip, I guess. No, oh, it <laughs> just respawned. Yes. I noticed that the one by the beach did too. Period. I have close button dryer. All right. Yeah, Michael, if you're still in the chat, we're just waiting in the ruined village. At the bridge? Okay. Uh, this one just respawned, so. <laughs> In your absolute favorite world, facts. Celestia really could be better. Captain. What are you doing? Legend Death? Because Legend Death, that was real fun back in the day. Not gonna lie, I don't think it's that bad. They could just use a graphics update and maybe they can cut some content from Crustacean Empire and it's for real. <laughs> Honestly. Can't wait to get to Celestia on my eyes. Get the skip world of elixir. That's real though. So, uh, did we leave Deadshot somewhere? Oh, oh, okay, he's back. <laughs> Desync is crazy. Yeah, Legend Death back in the day was so fun. <laughs> it's like Poison Headless. 
loved that. Loved that era. I hope they had a skip world <laughs> elixir for Azteca. I might actually buy that. I feel like that would sell. I don't know why they haven't put that out yet. World skip for Avalon. Yeah. Did Legend pave on all characters? Legend was a fun bracket. It's like even Legend Life. I wanted to do Legend Life. But then the Caramel update dropped and I quit for three years, so. <laughs> Yeah, 500 quests between Azteca and Chrysalis. Yeah, that... It always struck me as just real excessive. <laughs> that they... That the later Art 2 worlds were crazy. Not fighting the Sword of Kings, and then we find it, and then we get it taken away. It's real. Sword of Kings thing in Avalon was kind of whack. You know, I wonder how many streams it's going to take for me to uh, max out all my stuff. This tech is very pretty with good music, though. That is true. To a degree. Questing through it with the bosses is a drag. That's real. That's really the main thing. It's just the gameplay in Azteca is so bad. Story-wise, Azteca is like really good. Toward the end. Legend Method Pigs and Medusa is probably my favorite. Yeah, dude. Medusa Blade Pigs. That was a <coughs> that was a favorite of mine. Back of Pigs is only five pips. <coughs> I did some Legend Myth as well. Pretty much every school except for like Fire and Balance was fun at Legend. <laughs> so here's the same with Imperia, it's custom to 170, that's real. Fourth arc is a breeze. By the end of Azteca I'm happy because I just watched the world burn for real. It's like you spend all that time there. There's even a line where it says Morganth. It's like Morganth is like, my forces deterred you down below. And thinking about how many quests are in that world, it's like, are her forces really like the bosses, or are they just like the people who say, go get my rattlestick? <laughs> you know? It's like that type of deal. For Byron, if they had that under the skip Aquila elixir. Aquila is like. The only thing about Aquila is the ship quests. Really don't like those. Those are those are a pain to do. But otherwise Aquila's fine. Used to run 30p of a fire and storm and it was a thing. So that's like Wild Bolt Simulator. <laughs> I didn't really do much pay below level 60. Makes more sense for forces with the ones giving us those deities, for real. <laughs> for real asking us to make them a sandwich. Facts though.
Dude, my game is like freezing. The Oracle, that's real. In the early part of Aquila, that's where the, the ship quests are at their worst. Ship combat and her and Achilles, yeah. Once you get past Troy, though, it's uh, it's a lot more fun. Deadshot, I'm not gonna lie. I think your other character might be blocking the spawn. <laughs> that sounds. I swear to God, made Aquila unplayable. Facts. It's got a nice little story, though. Christmas Part Two honestly restores my drive to play the game. Honestly, yeah. It's like part one is a little. Part one is honestly, I can compare it to Pirate Aquila. And that's like I do when I get to Aquila, I take a long break because I despise that world for real. Block all the spawns except the two next to each other and hit them on respawn? That's real. Could do it. If you had enough accounts. <laughs> Late Arc 2 just sort of has that little charm to it. I come back and just try to push through to get out of there ASAP, yeah. It's like soloing an Aquila, that's the main thing that's just pain. The Hydra, dude, the Hydra boss, oh my. It's always pain, especially on like Musketeer. Melee classes have a much easier time with it. I feel like. Arc three is honestly so peak. Worlds are fast. Story is good. Honestly, yeah. It's like a, it's it's a lot of people's favorite arc. I think it's mine. My favorite arc, personally. I like arc two story better, but arc three, it's just it's right up there. It's a very close second in terms of story, but everything else about it is just far in the lead. <clears throat> what are good ways to get 9% pip opals? I can't really speak to 9%. The only way I know you can get them for sure is by like buying them with arena tickets, but you can't do pity for that. 10% though, those will drop from Polaris onwards. Valencia is nice for what it is, for over Aquila and I will die on this hill. Come back to me when you take a swashbuckler through Florenza. <laughs> Pain gets redefined trying to do that. Pretty sure you can get 10% from Bingo. Yeah. You can buy them if you've... Uh, whichever one is the triangle slot boss. Crash, I think. If you have the crash badge, I think you can just craft them for Dream Water. Arc 4 is also good, but I feel like very story wise, they rub themselves into a corner because in Arc 3 we literally become a god. Like, they really can't make us more powerful. Oh, we gotta go fast. We gotta beat him to the bunch. I've settled it on Swash Nuts Lock format. Ooh. Yeah, it does. It does take like running, running scratch and spamming poisons and Duomo. It's like that is that is so pain. It's the worst share, but it's doable. Fair enough. Did not make it to Kane, but made it pass very far. It's the one time I bothered to use knives. Facts. What's good, Noah? Welcome to the stream. Kane, I tried to solo way back on this channel's first, I guess, wave. I'll go ahead and take us back to the TP hub at this chest.
but I don't think I was ever real successful. I might try to do it again if they ever run like free membership, because ain't no way I'm buying that. Honestly, not looking forward to maxing my remaining characters because I need to pay for the next character slot. Yeah. Managed to solo cane regularly on Swash. Took a couple attempts though. Yeah, that's fair. Probably need a, like a lot of hides for that. Queen is the problem, and so are those uh, those I guess pawn looking things because they can turn into queens. So you got to make sure those go down quick. I always recommend doing it during Miracle Match, that's facts. I actually have the, uh, <laughs> the Defeat Kane 50 times badge on my Musketeer. Just because I would spam. Like, with Overwatch 5. I haven't played Pirates since they added the Dreadnought. Yeah, it's, uh... It's honestly been quite a while since they added that, I think. Maybe 2017 was when they added that. The Haywire weapons were crazy, honestly. Queen, honestly, I just let her cook, and it's just RNG usually, but with Ratbeard it helps. Ratbeard is a lifesaver in that fight. Because you, like, hold the line 3, uh, repel 3, with clear the decks, it's just, it's great. He is the only reason why that fight is so lovable at all. I feel like whenever I queue into a PvP match, nothing ever happens. Elaborate, question mark. Because <laughs> I got no idea what you mean. Like it says, it's finding people my skill level, but it never does. Yeah. Q times, they'll take a while. It also depends on what uh, level you're queuing at. Like the max bracket is alive, but a lot of the others just aren't. Frost Giant, for real. Here to stack, y'all. I might end stream after I run out of energy on my storm. So it might be like uh, one more round of this. Seven hundred from that one, so guys. Okay, there's one over there, but I'm gonna check the beach. Oh, there is one. Got a bunch of giants from that one. Got three. Cheer loud. <laughs> Bruh. On my screen, it looks like that went way off. So I'm gonna run out of characters, that's real. 
Feels so weird not having any exams until next month. Last week I was literally in the Nightmare Dungeon IRL and I have actually nothing going on. I feel that. Got swap? Alright. I'll run us back to the teleporter hub. Or, I guess I'll just add you to the group. <laughs> One in two days, yeah, good luck, Frenzy. Oh right, yeah, I'll just run back. Or, <laughs> your brother's just TP. So. Okay. I like click on you. Okay, there we go. Oop. Okay. <laughs> I am speed. <laughs> Damn, nothing here. This is the first time I haven't ever seen one. But okay. God, you don't have energy on this character. Oh, yeah. Pros in the blaze life hammer on that, for real. So I can hit three more chests after this one, the looks of things. Uh, if anybody in the chat wants to help the boys farm after I'm gone, jump the Grey Rose. Off too late, I was on a train, tough. It's <laughs> tough, especially because I'm about to end in a few minutes here. It's like the time Squidward OD'd on Benadryl, for real. Dollar Bob that MP4. <laughs> A lovely day for real. Once Moon School tier list. Uh, I'll probably do that Saturday, to be honest. Don't really have another idea <laughs> for that. You ever want to run another one of these streams? I'm down. I'll probably do another one. I'll see if I can do that tomorrow. Because I don't even know how many spell limits I've got. Like, I've got 25 Novas on this character. I can at least upgrade um, my spells once, I want to say. All F tier, that's real though. It's it's like I make uh, the one like the meme tier on every on every tier list and polymorph is just gonna be that one for the moon school. So those shift spells were good ones. Yeah, and I, I am gonna rank those with it. It's like originally it's like when, when Frenzy originally suggested the Moon School tier list, I was like, you know, I could throw in the shift spells. So that's what I'm going to do. You should test out each polymorph. <laughs> oh my. I need to be going for Master Shapes and that uh, adjusted free point buyback, so. I have 11 training points. Thinking about it. <laughs> Test the polymorphs extensively. Probably just get TCs. 
in a mob fight in a polymorph took like 10 minutes. That's real. Isn't the moon school? Or no, the moon school trainer isn't here. This one has the sun school. But yeah, I'm able to hit one more chest and then I'll probably end. Storm polymorph gonna go to that, not gonna lie. Polymorph bandit. Eon Polymorph gets its own special place in hell, for real. <laughs> Alright team, this will be the last one that I hit. For the day. I'll probably be back tomorrow with another stream of this. Sounds cool, just outside somewhere along with moon stars to in a dungeon. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, that's uh, that's in the lunarium. Well, team, that is gonna wrap up this stream. Uh, I am probably gonna go ahead and put my clown car back in the shared for my ice. That little car mount is so cute. Like, I just imagine little wizards crammed in there talking with each other. <laughs> like, oh wow, this, uh... Anyway. <laughs> like, oh wow, you know, this, uh... This, this little trip that we're taking here. I'm sure is energy intensive. Bank! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Yeah, I found out that uh, you get around that by just unequipping it. So, it was what it was. Bank. <laughs> Can I get a bank in the chat? But yeah. Thank y'all for coming out to the stream. What are they building over here? Is this on an island that just hasn't loaded in? What is Scuttle doing? <laughs> it's a meme in my server for real. Don't know what this is supposed to be. But anyway. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> thank y'all for watching. Uh, I've been Ice Killed. Thanks for coming out to the stream. I'll probably... I'm just going to defy physics as I end the stream. Alright, anyway. <laughs> I'm probably going to do another stream like this tomorrow. Um, or actually, before I end, let me quickly just uh, see how many spell limits that I've got. Okay, moment of truth. Is this fixed? Can I, can I go like school specific? I can! I finally fixed it, okay. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, don't need to transfer storm. Or Thriz. Let's see. I'll upgrade Frost Giant and I'll cast it once for the culture. Power Nova. Gotta do it one time for the team. Okay. Gotta throw in the, the main set. <laughs> Gotta have it. I'm missing any pieces. Uh, I don't think I am. Gotta cast Frost Giant one time. <laughs> AK Giant turn two, yeah. I hope so. I can upgrade it, let's go. Not doing that. Not ever. And then I'm gonna use it on those Celestia mobs. <laughs> Alright. Cause I got two. Look at that. <laughs> I already love looking at it. 880. 
We got by the path for us, uh, you know. Oh, maybe. <laughs> Time to send it. Nut. Nut. Let's do it. Run me my damage. It's only tier 2, but run me my damage. <laughs> Bam. 7.7. .7. that. Love to see that. And I got armor, so Celestian Totality. Alright, champ, open your mouth. Thanks for the sandstone. <laughs> Alright. But yeah, I will probably be back with another farm and stream tomorrow for these uh, for these spellments. So, I'm gonna <laughs> probably just go in order. I'm gonna finish up my... Uh, my tier... my uh, rank 7s first. And then I'll move on to 8, 9, 10, and then King Art for the last one. So, until then, thank you all for watching. I've been Ice Gold. Be sure to like, subscribe, leave a 50 comments for the algorithm. You've heard it all before. And I'll see you all.